All right, let me let me get my ladder. That tip any better? Yeah, not, not much. It, I mean, it's, it's a lot better actually. Yeah. It's a little deeper. Moving. Uh, actually, I'm going to get that. I'm going to try and put this one in from here because it steps in the way here. Can you pull on that? Nice. Very nice, sir. good it's good they line up nicely okay i'm gonna come up to about the middle i think you need to get a nail in the top you already got one don't you bill yeah push it in nice and tight what's going on as far as it goes in yeah. you got a little dip inside that yeah you know you're gonna have to put your screw a little lower that's what that means yeah so when it draws up pulls the flange down not so far where as you bend the metal, that's all. You'll be able to feel it. Yeah, I know what you mean. You might even might even have to do the top first, I don't really know. So To the right in between them two. Oh yeah, I got it. Whenever you get around to it. No, I meant a screw between them two screws. Here? No, right there. Yep. Right there. Nope, nope. Right there. Right there, yeah. you want? Yeah, one? I do. Alright. Sometimes you have to add that's you want me to do one here? Yeah, it's fine. Kind of... You should draw it up tight here. Yeah, it's a little loose. Oh yeah, you got it. That's good. Not as strong as I'm wow. I don't know. Oh come on, ball me. What'd he do with it? I don't know what he's doing with it. He lost it somewhere. Yeah, you know I lost it. Give it to me. And all of us used out. He gonna move his knife so I don't too. I'm gonna find out who your troop friends are. Come on. No. Come on. Come on. No, no, no. Uh, I'm gonna do the top first. Yep. Now you got a peak on your roof. Yeah. <laughs> you got a peak. Fancy, dancing. Yes, sir. Uh, right now, yeah, uh, really need to put, get this piece in for it all. Go right in, ain't it, Bert? Yes, Just look at that. Look at that. Ain't that pretty? <laughs> I like it. That's, that's gonna be good. Raise yours all the way up. Yeah. 
Teamwork makes the dream work. That looks so good. How do we handle them challenges, by the way? Uh, satisfactorily. I say so. Thank I'm you very much. Really amazing. I mean, I knew that was going to be an issue, but... Yeah. Yeah, really Man says that we're, we're going to come here and we're going to have to deal with some challenges. And uh, the challenges were for us minimal, minimal, minimal. Not so bad at all. <coughs> Pulse is looking pretty good. Hmm? Look at Bobo. It's all the way down the corner, Paul. No, there was three. Oh, you're looking for that one. Oh yeah, I thought it was one right there. I was gonna say there's one down there. Don't pass out, fall over forward. I don't want to hit the ground. You're almost done. <laughs> I will be the last man down. Captain goes down with the ship. He's the last man off. And this is why I want to show everybody. Look at this. He added an addition onto his trailer. He couldn't just add it down onto the side of the trailer. He had a big trough there. So he, very smart really actually, took um, some two by fours and cut them from nothing to something to nothing again and made a little cricket type deal right there into his house which gave him a gave him a huge addition which is awesome um, so we of course laying our plywood on here had a little bit of challenges to uh, getting our stuff lined up but as you can see and no, I didn't cut no perfect straight line there, but to be honest with you, there's not a straight line there because his line goes around, so my line's going around too. Sometimes you just get what you get. But this is our finished product in Chesapeake, Virginia. Yep. <laughs> Look at that. And I, I'll tell you, I'm gonna be honest with you, I, I get excited every time we finish one. Yeah, I get excited every single time I finish one. Every time, every time. Because of the way I feel about what we did for somebody. I mean, this guy's been struggling 
How long have you been struggling with leaks, Tim? Uh, two and a half, almost uh, three years. Almost three years. I've, I've uh, repaired this roof 15 times. Yeah, well, not anymore, and right? You're done. Everything I got, all my new siblings are soaked. You're done. You're done. You won't have to do that anymore, Tim. Thanks for calling us. We love helping people in need. Tim's been struggling for a while with this thing. I'm glad he found me on YouTube. Really am. Because he's really glad, I should say. But I'm really glad myself, so. I want to thank Tim one more time for this. Yes, sir. Stay in it here. Lay in here. I'm not taking it. Tim. I am going to say something, if you don't mind. Um, what do you think? You called us from North Carolina. We're done. You like it? Yeah, I couldn't be more happy. Yeah, three and a half years worth of struggling with roof leaks. Yeah. And uh, this is going to take care of you forever. Yep. Everything I've done inside, ceiling wise. This place is beautiful on the now. inside. Beautiful on the inside. So he's done a very good job. He's tried to make his his mobile home great again, and he's doing a good job at it. Now he's called Drew out here, and we came, and I think we made it great, at least on the outside. Yes, sir. So I want to appreciate the no work. I, I appreciate how you did the challenges up here. So. I know, man. I'm telling you, you said we had some. We did have some, but we overcame. Like uh, my buddy Clint says, adapt and overcome. Yeah. Thank you, buddy.